Alright everyone, so welcome back to another episode of Skyblock and in today's video what I'll be doing is testing out these new seeds which are grapes. So a lot of you might be wondering are grapes good, are they bad, should I farm grapes or should I stay on onions or what should I do, what's the best way to make money. So as much as I know at the moment is that onions are still better than grapes even though onions got nerfed in selling price from 35 per onion to $30 per onion and i really hope you guys like my face it's also purple because of the lore of grapes that i ate and after all it's really hard oh tall grass yes please give me that oh tall grass it's like weed okay ignore what i just said please uh can you like not do that? Thank you. So about the grapes, you actually have to have this thing where you plant it on. You can't just plant it on the ground and that's really annoying. And it takes really a long time to actually make these since they require a lot of birch wood. I hope that's how I pronounce it, birch wood. So it takes 30 birch wood per one of those stands or whatever they are called. That basically that place where you plant grape seeds. And I get about four birch wood per one tree and I need as I said I need 30 which yeah it's actually a lot just so I could place one of them and the really bad thing also is that grapes sell less than onions so one grape will sell for 22 coins if I'm right I can go ahead and check it right now real quick unless they change something which I don't think they did so I think it's still 22 dollars per one grape yeah it's still 22 dollars per one grape and you guys can see that I have 66 million coins I had 50 million in my my last video but I sold all the onions from grinding yesterday and today so I could get if I grind like full two days I can get like 20 million or something around that and also just later in the video hopefully I won't forget to show you guys how that iron farm over there works I promise you I'll do that in my last video because it was glitched in my last video and it unglitches kind of every time I reset the server and so basically what I'm gonna do of course is reset my VIP server and join it and then you're gonna see the full power of this farm and it can make around 30 iron every 30 seconds or something around that even though I would say it's in average 2 iron every 4 seconds or something around that so as you guys just saw these grapes sell for 22 each but what you can also do with grapes is make sandwiches and jam so if you would go to this cooking table you have this grape jam and you can make it by using two grapes so let's go and craft one of these and also what you can do then is go over here and make a jam sandwich which requires one grape jam and bread now that means you would also have to farm wheat for this and also spend time crafting and baking the bread which just takes a really long time so to make this sandwich what you have to do is first of all get this stand where you can place the grape seeds that takes also some time then you have to plant the grapes over here and then wait for them of course to grow up once they're fully grown up you harvest them and after you harvest them you need to harvest wheat so you can make bread so then you could make this sandwich and the process of making bread is first of all you have to have wheat so you have to wait for the wheat to grow up then you harvest wheat you make Make this over here and with these you bring them to the ovens or whatever these small furnaces and then you smelt it over here and that's how you get it bread so yeah it's a really long painful process and it really takes a long time meanwhile what you can do is just use for example a auto hotkey clicker and run through this just i don't have it equipped i'm not using the auto hotkey clicker at the moment so let me just open it real quick if you guys want to use the auto hotkey clicker that i'm using which basically spams any button you want to do it will be in my discord server in the announcement and you can join my discord server through the description of this video the auto hotkey clicker might not work for some people I don't know why it works for some for some it doesn't and for me it's everything fine and it's fine for my friend this this person right over here even though we live like on completely different sides of earth so look your location doesn't matter so I don't know what else could be wrong about these auto clickers not working on some computers and also now that I'm running this auto hotkey clicker let me just show you real quick can I fall down here thank you very much uh, I also have 27,000 onion seeds so I'll be 
giving those away all to my discord server okay so i have my auto hotkey clicker and now i just run like this and yes that's pretty much how i grind and how i grinded this 66 million so what i'm trying to prove you right now is that you can just do this instead of having to craft all that bread uh, grape jam, sandwiches, whatever, and what's good about sandwiches is they sell for above 100, I think it's 115, uh, we can check just in a little bit, but as you guys can see, I'm getting a lot of onions out of this, and I think I had zero, or no, I, I think I had more, I had like 400 or something around that, so let me turn off my auto hotkey clicker, and yeah, I have 791 onions, and I think I started with like 400 or 500 something around that you guys might be able to see how many i had if you go back in the video now let me jump back uh, i mean down here so i teleport oh i died okay well didn't really mean to die but okay still got teleported over here and my inventory gets messed up they should definitely fix so your inventory saves this hotbar because when you're also rejoining sir what the hell why does this also exist so let me get my normal loadout around here okay so this should be fine for my hotbar so you guys can see I have three jam sandwiches and wait for some reason doesn't let me eat them uh, I think you're supposed to be able to eat these but I guess I, I can for some reason and where you sell them is to this baker over here and as you guys can see they sell for 115 each so these three can be sold for 345 now I spent about the same time grinding those onions and maybe even more time grinding these three gem sandwiches so these three gem sandwiches will sell for 345 and if I would go over here to sell crops, let's see how much I can sell these onions for. So this is of course not how much I grinded right now, but you can do math around here and it's definitely more than 300. That's for like 100% sure. So let's go and sell all of these for 23,000. Here we go. So yeah, 23,000 compared to 300. Onions are definitely better in every possible way. Even if you're crafting these gem sandwiches or whatever, let's go over here and and try sell these grapes so all of these grapes can be sold for 4290 coins which is decent price I, I guess grapes would be really good if you didn't have to replant them so once you plant them they grow every time so you don't have to replant and I think that's how grapes actually work in real life because you plant the seed and every year you get grapes on those leaves branches whatever they're called i don't know english english is my main language so i don't really know that kind of words i would of course know how to say it in my language but yeah being english hard okay and let's not forget to mention they moved the banker over here and they didn't even bother to rotate him or even at least put him on the ground like he's flying he's a god god banker also i should probably sell my berries also i can sell them for 127,000. oh my god and you're like please go away this is why i use uip service it, people get really annoying so yeah that's pretty much it about grapes uh, they aren't good and they definitely need a buff they for sure need a buff because the grape seeds just in my opinion cost too much in the seed shop let me also just show you that real quick so if you go over here you got you guys can see that grape seeds cost 3000 per one and onion seeds cost 2000 per one and i don't know about you guys but i think that onion seeds are way better than grape seeds in the end you can sell these grapes for more but when it comes to how much money you make in some amount of time onions are definitely better no matter how many of these grapes you had because there is a cooldown on crafting if you could craft instantly then barely even then i don't think even then grapes would be better because you have to cook bread and cooking the bread takes way too long like <laughs> it's just too long process and takes too much time and it's much easier to just for example use auto hotkey clicker and run like this and you're just running holding your w key and that's everything you do it's not that complicated you don't have to grind wheat then grind grapes then make bread cook it everything like that no it's not that complicated so a best way you can make money is by 
using onions and if you're a new player around here in this game i would definitely suggest you to use onion seeds not to even bother getting some grape seeds because it's useless you can make a few sandwiches <laughs> but why what what was the point come on and also there is a new workbench workbench level 3 and i don't think i can craft it yeah i can craft it i need 50 stone bricks and stone also takes a long time to uh stone I mean, stone bricks take a long time to get also so that will take some time so yeah give me a few minutes i'm gonna make this and then i'll be back okay curious so so I think this should be everything that I need for this workbench tier 3. Okay, yeah, it is. So I was going to craft it. Boop, here we go. And I think it's in my inventory. Okay, it's right over here. And I should probably move some of these items. So it's, it just looks a little bit better, you know. So let's go with this uh, tier 3 over here. Then let's put anvil over here. Then tier 2 over here. And wait, where's tier 1? Do I have a tier 1 workbench? Uh, I don't know. I'm just going to put a cooking table over here so what do we have in this tier 3 crafting uh, station oh, crafting a oh, workbench sorry about that stone cutter coloring station stone bricks and nothing too special everything that we had before and there is something special actually conveyor ramp oh and look at this we also have doors i mean i can do that right now so let me just get a few of these pine trees okay that's four plus three seven and i got three over there okay so i have exactly ten so let's scroll down here and craft this one pine door yay look at this mom i have a door okay let's put it over here oh <laughs> yeah that's sick i love that now that i have this door over here no one can enter this cave down here Okay, so that should be it for this video. I've showed you guys the difference between grapes and onions and the final result is that onions are still better and I definitely think grapes should get the buff. Of course, let me know what you guys think about all of this down in the comments. And before I actually go ahead and end the video, I want to show you one last final thing and that's this farm how it works at full power. And for that I have to leave, so I just left Alt F4 and now let me go to my VIP server. Okay, here you go. So we we are in a VIP server and it just started like this server is brand new and there is no items around this farm and as soon as I get near it it should start spawning stuff okay here goes so it seems like it started oh nope well, doesn't work once again. Uh, all the items this spawn. Cool. Well, uh, it worked before this update, but I guess they changed again something in this update, and now once again it doesn't. Well, that's just beautiful. I do actually have a screenshot of like a ton of iron dropping over here, and if I find it, I'm gonna show you guys right now on the screen. So at some point it does work perfectly, but at some it just sometimes doesn't work at all. Doesn't just doesn't work. And why is it like that? I don't know. Why did they make it like this i don't know it's just in my opinion really though I'm, I'm not the one making the game i'm not the one making decisions so i guess nothing will change i would love if things would change and it would be much better if they do something about that than letting us make freaking sandwiches but yeah anyways as i was saying i'm gonna end this video here hope you all have enjoyed if you did make sure to leave a like and subscribe turn on post notifications to an enemy studio and to always be notified when i upload join my robots group for some merch i would really appreciate it also join my discord server for all the giveaways and everything like that you know everything already so yeah as i was saying hope you have enjoyed thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next video